Erling Haaland missed two sitters against Nottingham Forest on Saturday, as Manchester City fell two points behind Premier League leaders Arsenal after being held to a 1-1 draw. The 22-year-old Norwegian was eyeing a 33rd goal in all competitions in his remarkable debut season in England. Pep Guardiola's striker looked likely to find the net after his own effort came back to him off the crossbar. However, the former Borussia Dortmund player was left red-faced as he got underneath the rebound and blasted the ball into the stands. It came after Arsenal left it very late to beat Aston Villa 4-2 at lunchtime and managed to climb back to the top of the standings. City dominated possession and took the lead four minutes before the break, with Bernardo Silva slamming the ball into the goal from the edge of the box. Forrest's January signing Chris Wood tapped home at the far post to level six minutes from time and lift the roof off a damp city ground. The champions threw everything at Forrest in search of a dramatic late winner. The Sky Blues could not break the host's resistance leaving City two points behind Arsenal having played one game more. Forrest climbed to 13th. Pep Guardiola couldn't believe that Manchester City dropped two points away at Nottingham Forest on Saturday. It was a brilliant performance. We played really good, but we didn't score, Guardiola said after the game. At this level you have to score, and that is why we dropped points. The first half should already be 2-0 or 3-0. We conceded one shot on target and we dropped points. We are sad and disappointed, but the way we played was really good. We missed the chances we missed because today was not our day to win the game. We missed goals that were one meter to the goalkeeper, not just one a few. That is why we didn't win. What can I say? We played a really good game. We missed the second goal, and then after the second the third would have arrived. We have to look at ourselves. We can do better. For me Manchester City are the best team in the world Forest coach Steve Cooper said. They are fascinating to watch and study. There was no shame City had the ball as much as they did. I owe a lot of gratitude to the players for sticking to the plan.